Hey guys, welcome back to InventBox, and in today's Inkscape tutorial, I'm going to show you how to draft up some model gears. In today's tutorial, I'm going to be using Inkscape 0.92. So let's go ahead and get started. Drawing gears is actually pretty simple. What we're going to do is just draw a normal star. And normally whenever you draw a star, it starts out as a five-point star. I'll fill this in, get rid of the stroke. This is normally what your gear would look, or your star would look like, and this is just going to be the base for the gear. Now, we'll edit it and add eight spokes. You can. Th this is going to determine how many spokes is on your gear, so don't worry about it too much right now. Now I'm going to go ahead and go into the circle tool and draw a circle in the middle here. I'll give it a color that I can actually see, like red. And we'll center it in here. Now there's two different ways to center this circle in the star. One way is in the very edge over here. In the snap menu, you have these two different options. Check both of these and then make sure the top one here is on and this one is on so that these are enabled. And now if we drag this near the center, it will snap right there, and then we'll let it go. And now that's in the center of the star. Now if I take this off the center here, the other way to do that would be to do Control shift a and that brings up your Line and Distribute menu. Now click on the circle and the star and align them all on the vertical axis and the horizontal axis. And now these two are perfectly centered. So those are two different ways to get that centered. Now that we have these centered, I'm going to copy this circle, Control D, and bring it up, holding down Control and Shift, and then it'll scale it from the middle. And we're going to take it to about right here and move down to the bottom layer so we can see it. Yeah, about right there. Now we'll copy it one more time. Control D, and this one will be blue. We'll make it a little smaller. So right there. So basically, so this, um, this size here between the blue circle and the red circle is the same right here in this open spot. You'll understand once we do some of the operations here to make this into the gear. So now we're going to union the star and the circle. You can select them both by holding down shift and union them. So now they're one piece. Now select the red circle around the outside and the star and intersection. And now you can kind of see this starting to shape up. And now the middle, uh, the middle circle. I'm going to make this one a little bigger like that. Select the outside gear and select the inner circle and difference those. And now we have the gear with a hole in the center. And actually if we copy this gear and move it here, you can see it actually kind of meshes in the other gears. And now I went ahead and disabled snap mode by clicking the top one up here. So now you can do whatever you want with these gears. In a future tutorial, I'm going to actually take this file and put it on our laser cutter. And that's actually quite an easy process. It's not too intimidating. So I hope you guys found this video useful. If you did, don't forget to like and subscribe, and we'll see you next time.